huge result for Norwich. It came against Everton, who are in real trouble right now. Just one win in 13 matches for Rafa Benitez. And uh, we understand that Everton's board of directors are in conversation about him and his future this very evening. To put that in context, those 13 games, they've dropped from fourth place to 15th. They've taken the fewest points of any side through that period. And with Norwich defeat today, that means they've lost to all three promoted sides as well. It, it doesn't look very positive, does it, right now? Do you know, every time I see every time, over the last few months, I get the... But I must be right. It doesn't look like a good dressing room there. It doesn't look like... OK, they've, they've, and they've got some decent players. They've got some who turn up every now and again, which is no good to a big club like Everton. Obviously, Rafa Benitez, there's no doubt, will ultimately pay the price if they keep losing. He might do it tonight. But I get the impression that's not a, there's something amiss of that, again, that football club, or whether it be the culture, lack of characters, lack of leaders at the club. I know Seamus Coleman, he's a really good guy. But I think, I get the impression that's not a good, good dressing room there. Well, Rafa has said himself that uh, these are problems perhaps not of his own making. He said to the press this evening, Jamie, that I came here to fix issues that have been coming for the last five years. Mm. So it's, in a sense, he's saying it's... It's not on him. No, but a, there's a, to a lot of, to a certain extent, it's not on him, not all of it. But Rafa has a, a habit of causing chaos at clubs. He's a politician. He's always blaming everyone else. He's getting this person against that person. He creates a, an atmosphere with a crowd against the board everywhere he goes. And I'm convinced he's doing it again there. I don't see him lasting. Now, some people won't like the fact that we're talking about a manager that's in his position. I think he'll be out tonight, and I, I won't be surprised. <coughs> now, who do they go for? Because the Evertonians well, right now... It feel like he's halfway through a job? No, I They've don't been see it. It was never players. the right he fit. He hasn't had any money, Jamie, to buy players. Yeah, it was never the right fit, though. But, but you can't keep losing matches. Yeah, you can't keep can't. losing whatever the circumstance. If you're losing that many games, and we all know the manager will pay the price, whatever about project he had planned or whatever about future transfers mm -hmm. or problems previously... If you're losing week in, week out, and because of his connections as well with Liverpool, let's Absolutely. not kid ourselves, Everton fans will be... The fans aren't having him. They're, they're, they're not having him. They, they never, never wanted him I, in the first place. No, but, but then they're, they're, they're football fans, are, you know, genuinely, they want the best. They want to win. So they don't mind if, you know, whoever's managing their team, if they inadvertently win. And when they start performing like that, and you go to Norwich and you perform in the manner it did today, and we saw the game earlier on, it has to go. Now, Duncan Ferguson is the sort of person right now that's there... I think he'd do a great job because he did a pretty good job when he was interim charge last time. And try and find the next manager. People are going to talk about Wayne Rooney. Now, the job he's doing at Derby now is out of this world. The fact that he's even got him in a position, well, this will be the greatest escape of all time. Now, whether he's the right fit, I don't know. But it, that's the sort of options they're going to be looking at right now. Because it's not... People talk about getting players in. It's hard to get managers in. They've tried... How many managers have they gone through? They've gone through playing out from the back. They've gone through big Sam Allardyce. They've gone through everything right well, now. I don't big know names, what, that's for sure. I don't I'm know sure where they go next. there are plenty more out there who are looking for a job. We'll, it's a great club. We'll see what happens. Uh, Rafa Benitez's future apparently under discussion this evening. You can follow that story on Sky Sports News.